I'm running out of time, every day goes by so fast And every moment counts, baby, I don't want to miss a thing We can sleep under the stars, we can sleep under the stars Or hang out in hotel bars, driving somewhere in your car We can sleep under the stars, we can sleep under the stars Under the stars Okay guys, so I'm going to be giving you a tour of my living room and my kitchen and I'm going to try and tell you where I got everything because I get asked these questions so often and I have been promising that I would do an updated tour and kind of let you know where everything is from. So I'm going to start with this staircase wall here and show you, talk about that stuff and then I'm going to move my way on into the kitchen so and the living room so here we go so i get asked a lot about these frames and they are all from hobby lobby everything on this wall is from hobby lobby except for this right here i had this custom made by a girl her instagram is bow baker and i am going to have it linked for you guys below she has an etsy to and I'm gonna have it linked for you. And she has also given me a coupon code for you guys to get 10% off. She makes all sorts of really cute farmhouse decor and she can custom make it for you. So definitely head over there and check out what she has. And if you have anything in mind, you can always send her a picture and let her know and she'll probably be able to make it up for you guys. So I love that though. It's one of my favorite things in my house. Moving on above the door, I have this shelf up here. And I got that plant years and years and years ago at Kirkland's. That's from Kirkland's. The flowers in it are probably from Kirkland's. The hello is from Hobby Lobby, as well as that deer sign, um, Kirkland's. And I think I got that lantern from Hobby Lobby. And this flower arrangement is from Kirkland's as well. And then I had this little cubby shelf custom made from somebody local and um, I just measured out what I wanted and told him what color and everything and he made it. And then the baskets are from Walmart. I love these baskets. Okay, and then that looks awful. I hate that. I really wanna get a bench made there with like a cushion seat and then cubbies underneath that we can kind of hide the shoes in, but I haven't found one that I like so far, but that's just what we have going on now. And then this rug is from, I believe Walmart. If it's not Walmart, it's from Target or Kohl's, but it's just a cheapy like $10 little rug. And then moving up here, I got this from Kirkland's recently. If you watched that vlog, you saw, I love it. It's so pretty and I got it on sale. I can't remember how much I paid, but it was like $14, I think. I get asked a lot about my windows here on the door, this pattern. That is like a contact paper type thing. We got it at Lowe's. We got it when we moved in this house because even though the glass is supposedly where you can't see through it, you still can. So if like someone was to come up to my door, they could look in and see. So I wanted something that created privacy, but that really didn't take away from the door. And I found this damask print and they had a bunch of different ones, but this is the one I liked. And it's just like contact paper. We just put it on and then took a razor blade and cut it down to size. It was really inexpensive and super easy to do. So that's definitely an idea if you have something like this in your house where you feel like people can see in but you don't want to take away from the light and stuff. Yeah, we've had that up there for I think six years and I haven't had any issues and I love it. So that's where we are. lamp from Target and it's a touch lamp. I love it. I have one in Kinsley's room also. Hers is like that aqua color and I have only been able to find them online. I cannot find them in store but that's where I got it from Target.com and then I got this little flower arrangement 
from Kirkland's. That is my sweet Oscar boy. And this is his ashes. And I got this little hello sign from the bullseye section at Target. And then I got the cotton stems from Hobby Lobby. And that is just our security camera. <laughs> And then this shelf came from Target. They have a bunch of different colors. You can get it in like white. Um, you can get it in a dark brown, which I have one upstairs. You can get it in this color. Uh, maybe like an oak color. I can't remember. They have a bunch of different colors and it goes on sale a lot. So you can catch it and get it for around, I think like $115. And I love it. It's so pretty. And I like the distressed look. So. That's where I got that. And then on it, let's see, this little tin um, tray or whatever is from the dollar spot at Target. And then the flowers are from Kirkland's. And then the frame is probably from Hobby Lobby. I can't remember. And then the B is from Hobby Lobby. And that is from Hobby Lobby. And Hobby Lobby. <laughs> And it does light up. Actually, the lights are still on right now because I don't know how these batteries are still going, but they are. You can turn it off and on, and it usually is brighter, but they're about to die. And then I got this box probably from Kirkland's, and I just have pictures in it. And then just some books that I have. That's a photo album, and then just some books. So I got this rug on Amazon, and the quality is amazing. I think that it is very affordable. I think this one was like $130 or something like that. Um, they have a bunch of different colors in this pattern and a bunch of different sizes. This one is the five by seven size. I would have liked to have had the bigger one, but when I originally purchased this, I got it for another room. And so that's why I got the smaller size, but I really love this rug. Like I said, it's a really good quality definitely check it out on Amazon. I think I have it linked in the description already, but if I don't, I'm gonna link it in there for you guys so you can go check it out. So you can look in the description box if you're interested. And then my couches I got from either Rooms to Go or Rooms for Less. I cannot remember, it's been so long ago and I get those two confused. But they're just leather couches and we've had them for about five four four years maybe five years something like that and they've held up really well they recline um this one reclines that one doesn't we could have got it reclining and i didn't and i kick myself every day for not doing it i really wish i would have because i always sit in that seat i don't know why it's just like my seat and i'm always wishing that it had a recliner so that sucks. If you're between whether you should get one or not, get a recliner. And then my sweet Tucker boy. Hi, baby. That's his spot. He's laying on that blanket from Kohl's. I love that blanket. It's so comfortable. Let's see if I can find the brand. You guys helped me pick this out on Instagram. It's the Cuddle Duds brand. Yeah, I got it at Kohl's. And I got these pillows from Kirkland's. I get asked about these a lot. I found them online um, in store. They had some black and white checkered ones I saw the other day. So that was pretty. And then this is from the dollar spot last year from Target. And then this blanket or this little throw here is from Kirkland's as well. And then this sign here enjoy the little things in life or someday you will realize they were the big things that is from hobby lobby and then the lamp and the lampshade are from walmart and then my little scentsy warmer and i've showed this before but if you're new you haven't seen it my husband set a wallflower here and he put it upside down and they will eat right through your varnish so that's what happened there <laughs> these are from kirkland's um, and then my little coffee table and end tables are from, I think they're by Ashley, but they were from a different store. I can't remember the name of the store. Furnish 123 or something like that. But I think they're actually Ashley brand. And then this lifts up like this. And my husband loves that because he can sit on the couch and eat and watch TV. 
This tray was given to me by a friend, but I'm pretty sure she got it at Kirkland's. And the flower arrangement is from Kirkland's also. So over here on the fireplace, that home sign is from Kirkland's and the candlesticks are from Kirkland's as well as the candles. And the little flower arrangement is from Kirkland's. And the little bunny is from the dollar spot at Target. Same with this little bunny and the little succulent and his back is also from there. And the lantern is from Kirkland's and I have a little flower in there and that is from probably Kirkland's. <laughs> Kirkland's are Hobby Lobby. And then I have this candle up here burning. It is in the scent Orange Cream and it's by Country Scents. I actually had a subscriber send this as well as some other things to me. And I am so grateful because that was so sweet of her. They are so nice. So basically this company, Country Scents, is a lot like Scentsy, but they use better ingredients so they don't have chemicals or dyes, um, things like that in them. So if you're interested in having scents for your homes, candles and things like that, that don't have some of those chemicals in them, I would definitely check out this website. I will have her page linked in the description for you guys if you're interested. They have a bunch of different scents and they all smell amazing and they're all soy candles. So yeah, they're really cute. And I have that one burn in there. And that is Tucker's little toy box and I got that at TJ Maxx. So I get asked about this table a lot and my husband made this for me. We found the plans on Pinterest and it's called an Anna White X console table. And um, they have dimensions on there, but we just made it to our dimensions, like how high I wanted it and how long and all that, which you could totally do too. And then he made it and then I painted it and stained the top. It's my favorite piece of furniture that I own. I absolutely love this table. And of course it was made with love, so I love it even more. The frames are from Hobby Lobby or Kirkland's and then these little plants are probably from Hobby Lobby. Let's see if they still say. Nope, I probably got these at Hobby Lobby. And then again, the lamp is the same one as over there and it is from Walmart. And then that Farm Sweet Farm is from Hobby Lobby and that is really, really old. I don't even really like it anymore, but it's there and I got it at Kirkland's and then the bins are from Walmart and probably Walmart. I can't remember for sure, but probably Walmart and they just have toys in there. So. All right. So this little cabinet is from Kirkland's. I got it on a really good deal and I have the kids like Play-Doh and um, coloring books and all that stuff in there. And you can see straight through it, which I don't like. I'm going to eventually put some contact paper on there. I just haven't found what I want yet and I just haven't gotten around to doing it, but that's what I'm gonna do. That way it kind of hides all of that in there, but that's what's in there. And again, I just have like coloring books and markers and things like that. And then this little basket's from Walmart and it's kind of my husband's little thing where he puts like his keys and the gum and glasses and things like that when he gets home. So I just have it slid under there. <clears throat> and then these are his hats and that is from Target. It's actually a coffee thing where you're supposed to hang like your coffee in there. But I use it as a hat rack because clearly he has a lot of hats. And that is just all his junk and I need to go through it and make it nicer but I haven't really touched it because usually he yells at me if I touch his stuff. <laughs> but I need to go through and kind of declutter it. But that's what that is. And that flower arrangement's from Kirkland's and that Bless This Home is from Kirkland's. So here's another overview of the living room. Hopefully I answered where everything is from. So moving into the dining room, I get asked about this rug all the time and it is from Target and I'm probably going to be getting a new one soon just because I'm kind of over the brown in this one. I want something lighter and also my girls have gotten slime stuck in it. 
So I think I'm going to move it outside on the back patio because it can be an outdoor rug too. So I'm thinking about doing that and getting something gray for under there. But I did get it at Target and they do still have it and it goes on sale all the time. This is again a 5x7. And then my table is from overstock.com. I think Wayfair sells it too. Um, it's really cute and I like it a lot. But I'm going to be honest. If you have kids, I don't even know. That's sticky. Yeah, if you have kids, it will get sticky. Um, but if you have kids, I don't know if you can see all of these little ding marks and then there's a huge scratch right here. Um, there's a huge ding mark right there and I've only had this for about four months and that's like all of the wear on it and then I don't know if you can tell on this chair but on one of the chairs some of the white paint has already chipped off so if you don't have little kids i think it's probably a great table but if you have toddlers or school age kids that like do their homework and stuff on it i wouldn't recommend it so this table probably won't last too long it was 500 dollars, and i do love it but it's just not the greatest of quality at least not if you have like i said little kids because it does nick up pretty easily i can see in a year it being pretty bad and then I got this little milk jug from Hobby Lobby and the flowers from Hobby Lobby. And I just made this little arrangement. It's one of my favorite things in my house right now. I love the milk jug. So cute. And that is my desk. It is originally from Walmart and it was black, but I had it painted that antique white. And this little chippy tray is from Etsy and I will link her. Well, actually... I can't link her Etsy because she's closed right now, but that's where I got it. You can find them on Etsy. It's just called a chippy tray or chippy farmhouse tray, and they come in different colors and sizes. I love mine. I want it in a giveaway, and it's just so cute, and I get asked about it all the time. And then the flower arrangement is from TJ Maxx, and the lamp is from Kirkland's, and that is old, and I have no idea where it's from. I don't even really like it there, but it's what I have for now. I am shopping around for a new lampshade. This one's just really dark, and when you turn the light on, it doesn't add a whole lot of light over here. So, And then the mirror is from Kirkland's a long, long, long time ago, and the little things on the side are from Hobby Lobby. So this little stand here in the corner is from Walmart. Again, a very, very long time ago, probably 10 years ago I got it. Um... And then I just have some old cooking recipes and cooking cookbooks. I <laughs> can't talk. And then that was a gift from a friend. And this is from the Target Dollar Spot last year. You guys have probably seen these go around. They were really popular. And then this little flower arrangement is from Kirkland's. These curtains are also from Kirkland's. They used to sell them in my store, but they just recently stopped selling them in store, which makes me really sad. Now they only sell their curtains online, but they have really awesome curtains for a great deal. They're usually really inexpensive and you can always use your coupons, but they don't sell them in store anymore. That's where I got them. And then I got this farmer's market from Hobby Lobby. You probably saw this in a recent vlog. Um, I think it was 10 bucks and I love it so much. And then my trash can here, I asked you guys in a recent video to help me find a name for him because I think he's so sexy and I decided on Fabio. It was a close tie with Romeo, which was Kinsley's um, suggestion. And then Brad, I really liked Brad too. But yeah, he is, this is Fabio, my trash can. I got it at Bed Bath & Beyond and I used my 20% off coupon. And I really like it, it has a little, part in the back where it holds your trash bags which is really nice so when you take one out you can just pull one out of the back and replace it and then this little rug here is just from um, bed bath and beyond and it's a pet rug that like absorbs water so when tucker comes in he sits on that and i wipe his paws okay so for my kitchen i'm gonna start right here and I got this at Kirkland's and then this is another little thing that Ashley sent me from that country since website 
and it's just a little plug-in warmer. It says follow your dreams and I have a wax melt that she also sent in there and it smells so good. It started smelling like as soon as I put it in there, which I love when they have a, when scents are really strong, I like that. So um, that's where I got that. And this little cupcake stand is from Target in the dollar spot. And then I have a Bath and Body Works candle and spiced coconut milk. And then I got these canisters from Kirkland's, but I have seen them in places like Home Goods and TJ Maxx and places like that. But they usually come separately, and when you find them in places like that, I don't know if it's like they get them because one in the set broke or something, but you can get the whole set at Kirkland's, and they do still have them online. So if you don't have a Kirkland's locally, you can look online on their website and find them. They have different ones too, but those are where I got those. And then I have this candle thing, a candle sleeve or whatever you want to call it that I got from Walmart and the candle in there is from Kirkland's and it is a really nice candle and it's by the cobblestone brand and it's in cupcake and it smells so good. I love that candle. And then I got these drawers from Hobby Lobby and I get asked about these all the time. I love them. I like to keep like my pens and things like that in there. And then I just have some post-it notes cause I'm constantly writing notes. And then I had this sign made. It was a friend of mine that had the little company or her little business. She made these, um, she doesn't have it anymore. So sadly I can't link it for you guys, but it just says in this house, we do dog tags. We do patriotic. We do distance. We do last minute. We do deployments, have fun. We do really loud. We do hugs. We do Skype. We do mistakes. We do brave. We do real. We do love. We are blessed. So I got this sweet tea sign from the same girl who made the Chippy Farmhouse stand, but like I said, her Etsy is closed down right now. So if you want something like that, I know that the girl that made my Let's Stay Home sign could make something like that for you. And I get, again, I have a 10% off coupon, so you could definitely ask her to make you something like that and look around on her Etsy. She might already have one made, so. And that farmhouse one, another friend made that for me. I love it. And then starting over here, I got my coffee maker from Target on sale around Christmas time. And then that little, the, this little thing is probably from Target too. And then that's just a banana hanger. And then my bread box is from Hobby Lobby. And this is from Kirkland's. And this is our little charging station. I just had my husband drill a hole in the back here for us to slip cords through and that's where we keep our phones and ipads and things like that and it keeps them out of the way so that it's not an eyesore and i love it it's been working out great and then i got this little utensil holder at kirkland's i used to have it in this blue color here but i liked the white so i picked it up in white and then the gratitude sign is from Hobby Lobby. I get asked about this stool a lot. It's from Kirkland's. I have two. This is the bigger one, and then I have a smaller one upstairs. Madeline uses this when she's cooking or getting a dish out or something like that from the cabinets. And then I have the one upstairs for the Kinsley to brush her teeth with. And my knife set is from Walmart. It's by Pioneer Woman. I love her stuff. It's all really good quality. Everything I've ever had from her, I've really liked. I have her pans and I love them as well, but that's where those are from. And then this little, um, what you might call it? What are these called? I can't even remember what these are called, but you know what they are. <laughs> I got it from a company sent it to me from Amazon. Their name is Life Bits and it came with the letters like that and it came with a little box to organize them all in and then i got the bigger one that says happy i got those in a set from target they had a bunch of different words and little things like those flowers but i actually colored those flowers with dry erase marker but they're normally just white but yeah the little set that had a bunch of really pretty like words and pictures came from target and my little owl here is from 
Bath and Body Works. I have peach in there right now and it smells so good. And then of course my Mrs. Myers, which is my favorite cleaning stuff. And the little tray is from Grove Collaborative. And I have the new or the limited edition spring scent in lilac. They have peony and maybe another one. I can't remember, but this one smells amazing. I'm obsessed. I am going to be ordering a bunch of these before they go out because they are limited edition because I need to have them year round. This is probably my favorite to date aside from I really like the apple cider in the fall, but for spring and any other time, the lilac is my favorite right now. And I actually have a coupon code in the description box for you guys to get this entire set. Plus, I'll show you this. They have towels like this is from Grove. But the one you will get is this one here. And their new color, Cornflower Blue. So you can get all of this for free if you use my link and you're a new customer. If you're an existing customer, you can get free sponges, but yeah, it's a really good deal. This stuff is amazing. Definitely try it out and get it before it sells out because like I said, it is limited edition. Okay, so the balance is from Walmart. I got it online on walmart.com a long time ago. I get asked about that a lot. And then the rugs in here are from Kohl's. So this is just a frame from Hobby Lobby and I took the back off and glued magnets and I put my cleaning list in it and this is available for you guys to print off in the description box of all of my videos and I just put it in here because now it's like dry erase so I can check off things as I go and then when I'm done I can just wipe it clean and then I got this menu. Here, let's take this off. I got this menu from Amazon. It's just a magnet menu and you can write on it with chalk marker and it's really cute. I like it a lot. And as you can see, I have nothing on it right now. <laughs> One more thing I forgot this up here on my wall so down there's a living room and then up here that is from Kirkland's as well. 